What I want you've got It might be hard to handle But like a flame that burns a candle The candle feeds the flame John, like Lindsay, is nothing but 100% himself at all times. John is also kind and has a great sense of humor. That makes them similar in their greatest strength and allows them to complement one another so well. Once you realize this, it is not hard to see why they have chosen one another. Whenever I see them together, I can see how happy they make each other, and that is more than I could have ever wanted for my sister. You make my dreams come true. When I was trying to come up with something to say today, my sister asked me if I was going to roast John and Lindsay. Well, I'm going to leave that to the maid of honor and the best man. I am, however, going to recite a marriage quote I recently came across, which best describes Lindsay and John. Twist and shout my way out and wrap yourself around. Lindsay and John, beautiful things happen when two hearts come together and promise to live as one. Lindsay and John, I believe I speak for everyone here in saying congratulations. Finally, it's official. We love you both. Thanks, everyone. Well, 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 you You make my dreams come true I'm down on the day dream The street lights will be over by now Hey I says you baby You make my dreams come true Oh now where I am I know that it's you baby <laughs> You make my dreams come true <laughs> Welcome family and friends. Thank you for traveling from near and far to witness the promise John and Lindsay are about to make to each other. I am honored to be here and honored to join together two of my best friends in marriage. Sometimes something happens that is better than all of the riches and power in the world. You very likely noticed it in the instant that your love began. You two have made a choice that no one else matters as much as the person standing across from you. And if you each take responsibility for the quality of your life together, it will be marked by abundance, peace, and understanding. And when two such people encounter each other, the past and the future become unimportant. What the boy felt at that moment, with no need for words, he was in the presence of the only woman in his life. She recognized the same thing because when you know the language, it's easy to understand that someone in the world awaits you.
is only that moment and the incredible certainty that everything under the sun has been written by one hand only. It is the hand that evokes love and creates a twin soul for every person in the world. Your love grew quickly. As John came to admire Lindsay's sense of humor, grace, and smarts, Lindsay grew to love John's quiet confidence, ingenuity, and optimism. And it was evident from the start that it was something special. So call it destiny, call it fate, or call it RJ's retirement party. It was meant to be. Lindsay makes people laugh and is a joy to be around, but her sense of humor also makes people feel at home. She comforts others and makes everyone feel included and never judged. It was so wonderful to have a sibling like this growing up. Unlike others I know who were annoyed by their younger siblings, I always wanted her to be around. Lindsay makes every situation better, happier, and just more fun. Lindsay has a heart of gold, and she is uh, nothing but authentic. There's only one Lindsay, and she's never anything but 100% herself. She makes the most ridiculous faces, has the craziest dance moves, and has rocked some of the wildest fashion choices over the years. She definitely does not try to impress anyone. That being said, I'm sure she actually does impress others quite often. And one individual she's clearly impressed is John. If you know John, uh, you know John's an extremely special person uh, with, with lots of very, um, let's say, unique qualities. So, so I'm thrilled to talk about all the things I love about John tonight. Uh, thing number one, the guy loves to have a good time. Uh, no one loves a good time more than John. Second, John's an optimist, a, a forever optimist, the most optimistic person I've ever met. And then third, uh, my favorite thing about John, John is um, a free spirit who truly does not care what anyone else thinks of him. Um, we saw last night, John loves the tambourines, a big, 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 big tambourine guy. Um, John actually plays uh, the tambourine in, in a 90s cover band on the weekends. Uh, <laughs> maybe you all have been to a few of his gigs. These rings are a tangible symbol of your ongoing commitment to each other. As you join hands today, you make the promise to love each other today, tomorrow, and forever. And many years from now, may you look at one another and be able to say, with you, I lived the life I always wanted to live. With you, I have become the person I always longed to be. By the power vested in me by the state of New York, I now pronounce you husband and wife. John, you may now kiss your bride. And 
while Grammy Ange and Papa Jim cannot physically be here with us, I know they are here with us in spirit. And furthermore, I know that Grammy Ange would be saying, I can't believe my little Lens is getting married today. But in the same breath, I know she would be saying how happy she was that you were marrying Macaroni Boy. Lindsay, you're an extremely special person. Lindsay is warm, she's kind, uh, she's gentle, she's selfless, uh, she's laugh out loud hilarious, she's down to earth. Uh, I think you can tell a lot about someone's character by how they make you feel when you spend time with them. And when you spend time with Lindsay, you feel loved, you feel listened to, uh, you feel like this person is in your corner and has your back, uh, whether you've known her for five minutes or five years or for your entire life. Lindsay's very present. She hears you when you speak. She's not looking at her phone when you talk. John, put your phone away. Lindsay helps John pick up on social cues, uh, like when it's time to leave their friend's apartment because it's late and we're tired and we just want to go to bed. <laughs> Watch the one who will leverage his business connections to fly himself on a helicopter to Tuesday date night because he just can't wait until Friday to see her again. And that's John and Lindsay for you. Uh, so with that, I want to raise a toast to John and Lindsay. Um, you're incredible people. We all love you guys. Um, we're so happy for you. We just can't wait for you to take this journey through life together. So cheers to you guys. If you're shy, you're in the wrong place. I need to see everybody on the dance floor. Come on, hey. No one's getting up. What's happening? Let's go. Woo, woo. Listen, baby. Ain't no mountain high. Ain't no valley low. Ain't no river wide enough, baby. You need me, call me. No matter where you are. No matter how far. Don't worry, baby. Just call my name. I'll be there in a hurry. You don't have to.
to get up. Hey, we know y'all know Ooh. this. One. Keep it going. Hey, uh. come on, bass. Hey, 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 hey. Yeah, feel that in your bones. Johnny!